It's said that a household vacuum cleaner can lift an entire car. To test this rumor, Jimmy brought in a household vacuum cleaner. It can lift a five-pound metal block. Through calculations, we find that it can pull about 2.8 pounds per square inch. So, how could it lift a 2,800-pound car? That's the problem they need to solve. First, Jimmy creates a vacuum suction cup. The suction cup is connected to a hose. Then, using a specially made manifold, the vacuum cleaner is connected to the hose. Incredibly, the vacuum cleaner that could only lift 5 pounds is now able to lift a 50-pound metal block just by increasing the surface area of the suction cup. This shows that lift is directly proportional to surface area. So, to lift a 2,800-pound car, they would need 1,000 square feet of suction area. According to the calculations, they plan to make 40 suction cups. These would be placed on the car's roof, trunk, and hood. All the hoses would be connected to the vacuum cleaner through a manifold. Each suction cup also has a threaded steel rod, which links to a support structure. Once the vacuum cleaner is turned on, a crane is used to lift the support structure. If they can lift the car, it means the theory works. Otherwise, it means the experiment failed. It's a pretty cool experiment. Do you think it's possible?